Between Lake Geneva and the Jura Mountains lies the heart of the Large Hadron Collider, or LHC, a 27-kilometer long ring of giant magnets and four detectors. In the coming years, researchers want to accelerate more particles in it than ever before and make them collide. That will create many more exotic particles of matter for the huge machine's detectors. But it makes it more difficult to identify the most interesting ones. So the researchers at CERN want to build their detectors to be faster and more sensitive. This component is what's called a muon chamber. Muons are charged particles that are so heavy and stable they can penetrate all the layers of the colossal Atlas detector. For the CERN physicists, muons are indicators of new, hitherto undiscovered particles. Units like these can measure the trajectory and energy of muons. Inside it contains 400 separate tubes. Each is filled with an inert gas and contains a filament. The unit is just one small part of a detector layer that's the size of a football field. There are around 1,200 muon detectors like these in the Atlas instrument. That's more than a million filaments in all. And the wires in the muon tubes have to be adjusted in the micrometer range. That's the challenge in building detectors like this. In this lab, the physicists are developing another detector layer. It's designed for installation at the center of the Atlas array, where the accelerated particles slam into each other. The sensors in it track the first few centimeters in the trajectory of the particles created by the event. It surveys around 12 million distinct points distributed over just a few cubic centimeters. Around a tenth of all the data collected by Atlas comes from measurements here. Every day brings new challenges with new colleagues. You're constantly getting to know people from universities all over the world. They come with new ideas and detectors, and we try to integrate them. Scientists from around 170 institutes in 35 different countries have helped develop components that have gone into the Atlas detector. CERN is a focus of particle physics at the moment. And of course, being in the US, we would like to also think about some other options in the future. And maybe there, one day we also have as competitive facilities. Next year, the alterations to the LHC accelerator ring will be finished. Then the scientists will be able to investigate matter at energy levels never before achieved on Earth. And they hope to detect building blocks of matter that have never been observed. High on their list of hopefuls is the mysterious dark matter. The future of particle physics will be determined by what we discover or don't discover at the LHC, especially if we can track down dark matter. That would not only make the particle physicists happy, but astronomers and astrophysicists as well. Theory predicts that the vast majority of matter in space can only be detected through its gravitational effects. Discovering whether that's true and what dark matter is made of could be the next big breakthrough in the world's biggest research machine.